Okay, so the spring is stretched by 0.03 meters when 2 kilograms is placed in the basket. So we're talking about spring constant, so that's a force of the spring equals negative kx. So it told me that I'm solving for spring constant. It told me the displacement is 0.03 meters. And it told me the mass is 2 kilograms. Okay. So you're probably saying to yourself, all right, so negative k, easy enough. x is 0.03. What is f? Well, f is partly due to the mass, but it isn't the mass itself. Okay? The mass is not what the force is. The force is the weight. And weight is mg. So the mass times g, which is 9.8. So that will take care of solving A. Then to solve for B, you're going to use the other equation, period is equal to 2 pi square root of m over k. Forgot to mention, either f or x need to be negative. I usually like to make f negative because the downward force is pulling it down. That's just me. Um, you could make x negative if you want, but you should get a positive answer for k. Okay, so once we've got our two equations ready to go, so negative 19.6 equals negative k times 0.03. Divide 0.03 to both sides. And that gives me negative 653.3 equals negative k. Divide both sides by the negative and the negative cancels. So k is 653.3. Then we're ready for part b. Part b is to find the period. Period is equal to 2 pi times the square root of the mass, which is 2, over k, which is 653.3. Divide 2 by 653.3, square root that answer, multiply by 2, multiply by pi, and you get the period to be 0.35 seconds. There you go.